Supernova is a next-gen reverb and delay suite packed with dozens of the most advanced reverb and delay algorithms ever built. You get everything from ultra-realistic rooms to transparent natural spaces to lush, vintage, and colorful reverbs. Lifelike plates, halls, and chambers, and so much more. Plus, there's tons of creative delays and the ability to route between the reverb and delay engines for even more creative spatial effects. And today, we've added some incredible new features to Supernova that I'm excited to share with you. So let's get into it. First up, we have some incredible new reverb algorithms in the SFX verb section. These are four all new designs that expand the sonic range of Supernova giving you tons of new sonic possibilities. Glass is a creative algorithm that provides a wider, more hollow and open sounding space. And I love this one when I want a much less dense reverb. I love the clarity that this one brings. Void is another really fun algorithm that has a more artificial texture to it. So many of the reverbs in Supernova are so lifelike, but sometimes it's fun to have one that's a little bit more colorful. Open is an extremely wide algorithm. You notice this one right away, and it sounds like the reverb is just extremely massive, like it's wrapping around the stereo image. And I love this one when I want to spread a sound out across the stereo field. Cyber is another really fun, more artificial sounding reverb algorithm. And this one produces a much brighter, more articulate reverb tail. And this one is great when you want a tight ambience, but you also want it to be extremely wide sounding. I think you'll have a lot of fun with these new reverbs in your collection and using them when you want a different flavor on your tracks. One of the most exciting updates to Supernova has to do with the delay engine. In fact, it's not just an update, but a completely rebuilt architecture of the delay engine, allowing for some all new stereo delay algorithms. You'll find 10 new stereo delay modes inside for everything from creating subtle stereo drift to massive stereo offset and crossfading effects and everything in between. These have become some of my personal favorite delays recently. They bring tons of character to your spaces and can produce some really creative stereo effects. Take a listen to just a few of my favorites. One of the unique things about this new delay engine is that we can still enable ping pong even with the stereo delay modes. And this allows us to create even more expansive stereo effects. These new effects are so fun to play with. I think you're gonna have a lot of fun exploring these new stereo delay algorithms. It really opens up the sonic possibilities of what you can achieve with Supernova. There's one more thing. We've added a new output EQ section to Supernova. This gives you full tonal control over the wet signal. So you can completely shape the tone of your spaces with no compromises. The low, mid, and high EQ knobs give you a ton of range to be able to brighten, darken, thicken, or smooth out your spaces. Plus you have these filters in case you wanna completely filter out the lows or highs to create some bandpass filter effects. While you've always had and still do have the ability to filter out the delays or shape the color of the lows and highs within the reverb algorithms themselves, this just gives you an ultra fast and quick way to dial in the tone of the entire wet signal all at once. It's a great workflow enhancement and these EQ curves and filters sound absolutely incredible on all these spaces. Plus there's a ton of new pro presets in here making use of all these new features and algorithms. You're gonna have a lot of fun flipping through these. I always find a ton of inspiration in all of these presets. Everything we just looked at in this video is available right now as a free update for all Supernova users. 
Just click the Supernova logo in the top left corner of the plugin, then click check for updates and download the update installer. Make sure to close your DAW and any other apps you have open while you're updating your plugins, just to make sure that the update goes through successfully. We can't wait to hear what you make with all these new tools. Give this video a like, drop a comment down below and subscribe for more tutorials and updates like this. And as always, happy mixing. <laughs>